February 25, 1989, Frank Bruno was challenging a then undefeated and imperious Mike Tyson for his WBC, WBA and IBF World Heavyweight titles. Bruno managed to stun Tyson at the end of the first round, although Tyson went on to knock Bruno out in the fifth round. After fighting Lennox Lewis for his WBC title in Cardiff Arms Park in 1993 and losing, Bruno would have to wait two years for another title shot. On September 2, 1995, Bruno finally became world champion by outpointing WBC champion Oliver McCall over 12 rounds. Bruno did not last long as champion. The contract he signed to get McCall meant he had to face Mike Tyson in his first defense. Tyson was released from prison on parole in 1995 after he was convicted of raping Desiree Washington in 1991. He had fought two fights since his release, beating Peter McNeely by disqualification in his pay-per-view return and knocking out Buster Mathis Jr. After the victory against Mathis, Tyson was placed ahead of Lewis in the line of contenders for the WBC title. The fight was televised live on pay-per-view and generated 1.37 million buys. I must be him, I have to be him, I have no other choice but to beat him. And I promise you, I will not let you down. I come in with the belt and I'm leaving with my belt. Tyson entered the fight as a 5-1 to one favorite with $30 million purse, and Bruno's was $6 million. I think Bruno has a real chance too. I think, I think he has two, slim and none, and slim's out of time. reach advantage and here we go Rowdy. or anything but Mike Tyson is a feat. Tyson's trainer Jay Bryson he's, he's controlled as a belt he'll be very anxious a lot of problems as the way coming Tyson. straight in what you're going to see is Frank Bruno grab Mike he's, he's, old. he's not going to let Mike it, uh, their heads off Bruno with the question he does not like to fight on the inside generally he's What's learned that? to hold on he's his right hand he's got his jab into Mike Seven leans back he, he can't do that uh, you're too apprehensive on Mike's side, he's not bobbing. Right. Tyson's people wanted to bob and roll, be less of a target. That's the first one he talked to Steam tonight. Look on his feet, and that Bruno doesn't have the foot steam. Mike Tyson was the aggressor for the entire fight. Didn't seem to do anything, but it was a nice effort. And any time, oh, here comes Tyson. Tyson with a stop early. You can't fix a chin that was never great to begin with. A left hook by Tyson. Rest assured. Tyson him to stop. Yeah, Bill Slane trying to oh, take in every instance. Anytime he gets close to, it's to a punch, and if he's just worried about holding on him, it will because Tyson. Tyson, rounds, I guarantee you. Oh, a left hook by Mike Tyson, flush on the face of Frank Bono. Another left. He did not react as badly as he did to jitters. He may be settling in halfway through the second. What you call academic? Listen, Bruno switches yes. south. And that's saying something for 247. Tyson continuously attacked Bruno with right overhand punches, forcing Bruno to grapple with Tyson several times in order to weather the storm. In between, this is a similar way expected. He said he's not looking for the Tyson or Fort McGillian Mathis. Here's a combination uppercut by Tyson. Tyson laying it on, pouring it on. Down goes Bruno. Tyson is champion again. I'll fight anybody Don King put in front of me. And I, I just got, I have still have more to do and I have more improvement to do. I wouldn't right. my best. The new WBC heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. The match would prove to be the final one of Frank Bruno's career. Much more better than I really did, but I didn't they beat me fair and square, Mr. Dark. Though he initially talked about a potential third fight with Tyson. He was advised by doctors that he risked losing vision in one eye if he continued to fight and subsequently announced his retirement from the ring shortly thereafter. To say that I'm re officially retired and any questions you want to ask. Mike Tyson would next set his sights on the WBA heavyweight champion Bruce Seldon. Have you seen someone with a jab like Seldon's? Have you ever seen me fight before? However, Tyson's contract stated that he would first have to defend the WBC heavyweight title against number one contender Lennox Lewis. Don King eventually paid Lewis $4 million to step aside and let Tyson face Selden on the condition that Lewis would get his WBC title shot after. Tyson would then go on to defeat Selden by first-round knockout to capture the WBA heavyweight title. 